Get ready to save some money on your favorite tools as AppSumo kicks off their Black Friday sale early by introducing these drops. These are collections of tools around a particular theme and for 48 hours, they will have extra money off. So instead of being $99, for example, it would be $89. Today, I'm going to take a look at Drop One, which has all of these tools. They're returning favorites, and there's some real gems here. This first drop of tools is all focused on content and AI, so it seems fitting to start with Neuron Writer. If you've missed this, this was unlimited for a very long time. This is the first time it's come back in a while, and it's designed to help you optimize your content. You do that by giving it a search term, and it will then do the research for you to tell you what other people are including in their articles. There's a huge amount of information available. Do note that if you are on a lower tier though, you're gonna have a lot of useful features locked away. So if for example, you wanted the AI to generate an outline, that's locked away on the goal plan. So if you're gonna get this, I would recommend at least tier three. You do get some AI capabilities. It can help you generate a title and description. It just won't do all of the fancy stuff within the main article. Once you've written your article, you'll get a score telling you how well you're doing compared to the competition. And then you can go through the checklist to really optimize this so that it's as good as can be. I have done a further deeper dive on your own writer and that's pretty much still the same. I haven't seen many updates recently, so I'll put a card somewhere if you wanna go check that out. Your own writer has been hugely successful on AppSumo and gained a load of positive feedback. So definitely one to consider picking up if you've not had it before. Because of the way the AI system works, I would recommend really only going into this if you're gonna get tier three or above. Tier one and two might let you try it out, but to be honest, there's a lot of useful features that are locked away behind tier three. Next, we move on to VideoTap, a deal that bridges the written content and video content. This one has progressed since I first Got it, I'm on tier three. I get a lot of minutes, but it can be very useful just at tier one. Super easy to use, you give it a video. So here's a video I did recently on Jog AI. Once it's analyzed it, you now have access to a wide range of contents for you to repurpose. So you get these clips. So there's five clips has been created. It will also write a blog post and you can adjust all of these screenshots. And new, since I last reviewed this, it will also help you create podcasts as well. And it will generate emails. So if you've got an email list, you want to distribute it, you've got subject lines and email content. I would say the email content's actually pr pretty short. I, I think you would probably incorporate this into a bigger email. You can also generate tweets to promote it. And I love the fact they've kept it as Twitter rather than X. And it will also generate LinkedIn posts. And again, I would say the LinkedIn posts are a little bit short for how I would use it, but it's there to give you an idea. I like VideoTap a lot. I have been using it across a range of different YouTube channels to get me kickstarted in the content creation process. It's great the fact that you get the clips as you can see on screen, but you get the blogs and you get all these other little bits and pieces and I tend to use them and build on top of what's suggested as I don't always find it's done a great job in creating something that I would write for example but it gives me loads of good ideas. I like the fact that you get these clips as well it does a good job the captions look great but it's not the only tool that can do that and in fact if you're looking for something to churn out a lot of portrait type clips automatically I think you'll like the next tool as well. Mimvo is another tool that I've been making heavy use of. It is similar to VideoTap in some respects, but I've been using it to make really great looking shorts. Super easy to use. Once you've given it a link, you can either clip the video to shorts, you can add captions and edit, and you can post and schedule. So you can see here's the recent video I did on Jog AI, and we can select it to magically frame emojis. It could add media, but I'm not gonna ask it to do that. It can cut it, it can emphasize it, it can add sound and music. This process can take a few minutes, but it's worth the wait. I find this produces some really good shorts, especially if you are very visible in the video. My videos don't always work well because I'm sometimes just in the corner or a bit off camera, but on other channels I've got, this can be a brilliant tool. As these are very comparable tools, here's a quick demonstration of the output from both of them. 
you'll find there's a lot of settings that you can tweak and change. So you can change the styles and the look of it. And so this is just the raw output. And my recommendation would be to go and grab a code of each if these are looking like tools that you're interested in and test both because they both produce video clips and blogs and all that kind of stuff. And you want to put it through your own workflow. Don't just take it from me that they're both good. Test it with what you're trying to do to see if it works really well. I'll put affiliate links down below for both. And just to note that with video tap, because I've put a landscape video in, it's produced the landscape video, but I'm going to switch it over to portrait. So you get a side by side of what the portrait view looks like with the, um, the subtitles. Sticking with the video theme, let's check out one take AI. This is another useful tool I picked up. Unlike the others though, it doesn't create shorts. It takes your video and it can edit it and take out some of the ums and ahs. But the main key point here is that it will create a more interesting looking video by adding sliding effects and bullet points. The main use of this is you'll record yourself and then just throw the video into one take and it will edit it and add the main bullet points, add transitions, add these slide effects. And that allows you to focus on creating the content and not have to worry so much about the presentation. And of course it works with any type of video. So you could combine one take with something like Jog AI. Use Jog to generate an avatar reading your script and one take to make it look a lot more interesting. And as Jog allows you to create an avatar of yourself, I think this pairing could be a brilliant way to quickly and easily create professional looking videos. So we've got just three deals left to take a look at and only two of those are available to the general public. The final tool is for Plus members only. And the first tool to take a look at available to everyone is Deposit Photos. It's been on AppSumo before. If you've used it and you like it, it's time to top up your credits. I do wonder how much more use I'm gonna get out of Deposit Photos as AI image generation is now really good quality. And so Deposit Photos has amazing photos that I dip into from time to time, but I do think all image sites are now under a, a huge threat from AI image generation. But if you need high quality stock photos, you can't go wrong with deposit photos. The next deal is Supercopy. Now, I've got to be honest, I don't know anything about this. This isn't a tool I've used and taking a look at it, you know, it looks okay, but it kind of it strikes me as being something that you only need if you don't already have an AI tool that can help you with marketing. So this tool can help you match your brand with your target audience. And it's got a lot of templates built in to help you generate, uh, you can see here, problem goals, triggers, barriers. It's all AI content to help you with your marketing progress. I can't tell you if it's good or not. I've not tried it, but it's there. Give it a go. You can see their base plans are monthly. You can pick it up on AppSumo for a, just a one-time price. So it might be worth grabbing hold of one of the codes and giving it a try. The final tool is a Plus exclusive. If you don't know what Plus is, it's the AppSumo membership. You pay $99 for a year and that gets you 10% off all your purchases and access to some deals that are Plus exclusives. It is worth it if you're gonna spend a lot of AppSumo and they have run various promotions where you get a $25 uh, credit, basically, that you can use every, I think it's every quarter. And so if you do make use of it, it's time limited, but if you do make use of it, that means that you can effectively get your Plus membership payment back. And Squirrelly SEO is definitely one to consider getting a Plus membership for. It's not one I've actually covered on my channel, surprisingly, but it's one I've used a lot of. I got, um, I think whatever the max stack was for unlimited sites and I've got it running on about 20 sites and it's brilliant. I'm not gonna go through it all because it's got so many features, but it basically is a WordPress plugin, but you can use this with non-WordPress sites as well. So this replaces something like uh, Rank Math, Yoast, those kind of things. It will do all your SEO meta information for you. So you don't need to worry about that, but it also has built in keyword research, keeping fish because that's what this website's about. So we can do a very quick bit of keyword research, let's say aquarium water, filter maintenance, uh, fish tank decorations, do research up to 50 results. So this will now go away and do keyword research. So after a few minutes, it returns the list of keywords it thinks that are related to the topic. And we've got search results and the discussions. And so I can go away and start writing content for this. It will also learn about your site and give you suggested keywords 
and tell you if there's a high ranking chance. So I need to go away and write something about popular freshwater fish species. And so this has loads, loads built in. So we've got the, the one page setup, keyword research, it has briefcase to track certain keywords. You've got a live assistant, bulk SEO, automations. One of the best features they added in, index now. So there's tools on AppSumo where you would pay and it, all it would do is submit your new articles to index now. Well, if you have Squirrelly, it'll do that for you. You've got SEO configurations, focus pages. It can help with internal linking as well. It's got an internal linking tool. It'll do an audit. It'll do your Google rankings. There's so much there that it's just a fantastic tool. I've been using it for a while. The team are really good. They're always providing updates. And now, funnily enough, as, as I was just recording this, saying that the team provide lots of updates, I've just had an email providing me with another update. They also have a web dashboard allowing you to use some of the features with sites that aren't on WordPress. So you can still do keyword research and have the briefcase and get suggestions for sites that are not WordPress based. The other cool thing is if you are doing this with clients, you can create a package to install. So they won't necessarily have access and be able to use the keyword research, but you can still use some of the Squirrelly features on their website. So for me, this is a, an easy recommendation. I got the three code one last time, which gives me unlimited sites. You may want to take a look at the higher tiers just to check out if you want to do a lot more keyword research, they will give you more of that kind of stuff. But yeah, very easy one for me to recommend. If you like the look of any of these, I'd really appreciate it if you use my affiliate links down below to each of the deals that helps support me and the channel.